The unmistakable Cristiano Ronaldo in wonderful form. Can he add to his goal-scoring haul today on EA TV? Well, it's a beautiful day for football. No complaints whatsoever on that front here at Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as always, is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Manchester United up against Newcastle United. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. You know, when Ronaldo is on the pitch, we tend to think he'll stamp his authority on the game, Stuart. What in particular do you expect to see from him this time around? Well, how can you stop him? If you get too tight, he'll use the space behind you, drop off, and he'll turn and run at you. Add that to his movement in the box, and you can see why he scored so many goals. This is the team Manchester United will go with. David De Gea starts in goal. Rafael Varane plays with Matthijs De Ligt in central defence. Bruno Fernandes plays alongside Christian Eriksen in the centre of midfield. And the starting role and attack is handed to Cristiano Ronaldo. So they starting 11 for Newcastle United. Well, they're starting in a very solid 4-5-1, but they transition really quickly, and key to that are the wide players. They'll support the centre forward as soon as they win the ball back, and they usually do it with a lot of quality. And the match gets underway here at Old Trafford. Let's hope we're in for something special. Oh, what an opportunity! Well, that would have been a great start to the game, but that's a bad miss. Well, a goal update for you from the Manchester City game. Let's hear all about it from Alex. It's a goal for West Ham. They've scored the opener. Can he put it away? Opportunity. That's a great stop. Well, his reflexes are so good there. That's a fantastic stop. Corner kick played in. And tipping it over the crossbar. And that's a corner. Now sending it in, not messing around with that clearance. Miguel Almiron. Almiron. Surely! And a goal! 1-0! And what a fast start they've made to this game! Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging someone to get on the end of it. And it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. moving again what sort of response will we see from them now well to Alex apologies for having to interrupt you just then just to confirm West Ham did find the net in that game and their lead stands at 1-0 presently and he's gone into an illegal position unfortunately
Strength and control, a big part of his game. Sam Maxima. Is it going to be? Tenacious tackling, excellent defending there. Who can he pick out? A no-nonsense defensive clearance. Well, the pass not finding its target. Hayden. I must say, this looks promising. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. Well, I believe a spot kick award in one of the other games. Let's hear all about it from Alex. Yes, it was Chelsea that were awarded the penalty. He sent it. And will it be the leveller? Absolutely spot on with that challenge. Bruno Fernandes using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Almiron, they need to get bodies back. Ball is loose. Oh, terrific save from the keeper. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Marcos Llorente. Well, that save has kept him in this game. They now need to create one or two chances of their own. And you need your defender to take charge. Given away by Manchester United. Mario Rui. Darwin Nunez. And in with a real chance. Can they keep it out? And how well the keeper did. Well, that's just exceptional. He reacted so quickly there. Well, maybe scope for Newcastle to add to their lead with this set piece. Let's see about the delivery. Not the best clearance. It's a neat move. Still alive. And they can't quite take advantage in the end. Oh, big opportunity. And thumped away. Who can they pick out? Still not clear. Well, far from the ideal header. And the goalkeeper had it all the way. Shaw. Not showing good defensive judgment. Chance to play it in. Can he take advantage? And there it is! A two-goal cushion now, and they just need to keep the concentration. Well, let's look at this again. He's done superbly well to pick out a teammate here, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. Luke Shaw wonderfully weighted pass and there is the goal well that changes the equation and they have the momentum now Well, let's have another look at this, because he does really well to pick the right pass here. And it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. Back 
back in action then and you sense United have the momentum at the moment well, keeping hold of the ball is what it's all about for them Saint Maxima not quite the cross he was hoping for able to clear the danger corner kick though here Playing it in. And the header just wide of the mark. Well, he's given it away. And Newcastle pushing forward with options available. Saint Maxima. The possession lost, intercepted. The referee's verdict is three additional minutes. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. Saint Maxima. Oh, the threat is there. Well cleared away. Well, maybe scope for Newcastle to add to their lead with this set piece. And there's the delivery. Taking care of business defensively here. And that will do it for the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams. So the second half is underway. Newcastle United have the lead, but this is a long way from being settled. Subeldia. Well, he's going to be disappointed with that pass. Cristiano Ronaldo. And that is how to win the ball back from your opponent. Well, this is certainly the home of live football, EA TV. And looking forward to bringing you more action from the Premier League. It's Manchester United facing Everton. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Hayden. Darwin Nunez. Almiron. Real chance. Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Corner kick played in. And clears the danger. Mario Rui. Hendrick. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Well, a goal update for you from the Manchester City game. Let's hear all about it from Alex. It's a goal from... Rashford is through. Oh, a goal! They've done it! Quite the comeback, this!
Well, here we can see it again, and it starts with the ball over the top, perfectly weighted, and then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. Well, back underway here, and they've split the four goals between them so far. Well, unfortunately, we had to interrupt Alex just then. Apologies for that. Just to confirm, Manchester City did find the net in that match, and the match is level at 1-1. I'm delighted to say more Premier League action coming up for you here on EA TV. It's Newcastle United facing Norwich City. Well, that should be a really good game between two entertaining teams in a great stadium. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Well, I understand there's been a goal in the Chelsea match. Let's hear about that goal from Alex. It's a second goal for Chelsea. The goalkeeper's made an initial great save, but there's nothing he could do after that. They're pulled ahead by two with 67 minutes played. Many thanks, Alex. Trying to pick out a teammate. And he really read that brilliantly. They got the touch on the ball. A throw in now. Shelby on to Almiron Sam Maxima no spillage from the goalkeeper routine great pressure to win the ball back a chance to whip it in making sure nothing untoward happened Well, these fans are driving their team on here, but can United find a winning goal? Not long left now. It's a high-level tackle. Brilliant. Subeldia. Newcastle moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Fine cross into the middle. A terrific defending to stop them progressing. Cristiano Ronaldo. And the pass could do damage. Oh, it's astonishing! One of the greatest comebacks you're ever likely to see. And now the question is, can they see this out? Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. A dramatic moment near the end and that might well be the decider right let's quickly join Alex Scott because Alex I understand there's been a goal at Stamford Bridge yes it's a goal for Chelsea they're ahead by three now with 80 minutes played thanks for the update Alex went in strongly to win the ball racing forward trying to catch them out It did look on for them, but not to be. And now, passing it through. Well, at this stage of the game, you have to be more ruthless. Well, that just might be their last chance. What a miss that is. Here's a change for Manchester United.
Miguel Amron, to be replaced by number 23, Jacob Murphy. Well, with five minutes remaining and just one goal between them, still the prospect of late excitement in this match. Ronaldo, on to Bruno Fernandes. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Well read to put an end to that attack. And the counter looks on here, options available. Rafinha. Bruno Fernandes has it. Llorente. Magnificent defending. Well, they haven't overcome all the difficulties. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. Well, time is against them. They have work to do. Targets available. Cross comes in. Well, it's the late show. And they are level again. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. And level again here. This has been quite the roller coaster ride. And there it is, the full-time whistle. Well, they can't be separated, and goals very much part of the equation. Stuart, as always, interested to get your final analysis. Well, Derek, it was a really good game between two evenly matched teams. Both had their moments, but neither side really deserved to lose this one.